it's TV, but like you offer the person just what you need to get them to take it. You obviously don't really care about doing the show. Like if these are the, someone's like, there's no way these salaries are going to be this low. I'm like, I mean, I heard it from like actual people, like not people that work at Bravo, like the actual housewives is what I've heard. You talked to Luann, so I can figure this out. (laughs) No, it's not. (laughs) Believe it or not. It's not, I, that's what everyone is saying, but it's, but I do talk to Luann, but no, it's not Luann. It's shockingly other sources. It's, which is, okay. it's, no, it really isn't. I swear to God, but okay. yeah. So there, wow. you don't want to do the show, right? If you're offered, like if you're offering these and then well, maybe and if you've been making, you know, half a million bucks a year or whatever it was. And then all of a sudden now you're the old lady who's getting 50 grand. Even if it's for four episodes. You got to feel bad. I mean, it's like you're basically replaced by younger. Sent out to pasture. It really is offensive. So, you know, look, I mean, I've heard. Yeah. So they just figured like, I know, I think Sonia needs the money, to be honest with you. Oh, I hate to hear that. Yeah, I think she does. For real. Dorinda doesn't need the money, but like Dorinda's kind of like, probably why not, you know, just let's, it's five episodes. I'll take what I, you know, who cares? It's fun. Yeah. I mean, you know, the other thing is, you know, they say like, oh, just go on it. And this, you, you, you can't just go on and say, hold on, I'm going to hold up my, now they did it on Beverly Hill. Sure. But I know like on girls trip, like I know for a fact, two people on girls trip, the second one, they try to promote certain things and it's on the cutting room floor. So you can't just say, I'm going to take it and I'm going to promote my, my product. Cause if that's not in what they want, I mean, Beverly Hills is different with everyone's, you know, Kathy's tequila and all that, that became, right. a, but if you're just there and you're like, by the way, here's my product I'm promoting. And I'm took this job for 50,000 promote this. They're just going to scrap all that every time you hold totally. it up and talk about that. So that's not in they the don't, They don't either. care. Yeah, they don't care. And I know another, I know a housewife who went on girls trip too and was like, she didn't promote any products because they wouldn't let her. But she's like, during me being on the TV, I sold not one extra product. Like, it's not like, you know, I was on for four months and my sales spiked. So no. going on, it doesn't, it doesn't, it's not going to help that. So mm-hmm. look, do I think it could come back? I do, but it doesn't sound like it's really. So I think when people started dropping out and I don't even think they wanted to do it, they're just like, we don't care. Like, why, why are we trying to do this now? It's just in, I mean, do, do people care? I don't know. I'm not even being mean. Like, do people care? Are people around waiting for Jill and Kelly Ben Simone and Luann. They're, and they're going to come up with another city. There, I have a friend who lives in um, New Orleans, and she said that they're trying to do a pilot show. That's what I heard. Yeah, yeah. She's one of the girls that they want to do it, and she's like, she called me and asked me what you know, what do you think? And she told me, you know, one of the other names of that she's being heard thrown around who would be if this woman does it. She's a very well known person. It would be amaze balls somebody like famous let me, we all know yes jennifer coolidge who told you well <laughs> yeah. she well she lives in new orleans oh okay she lives there that i know and when we were so my friend we were one day driving you know now that i'm in la half the time we drove by her right. house and my friend was like oh you know this isn't even really her house i mean it is but she has another right, house right. in orleans and my friend is like a huge producer just not even with reality but he's in like right. the business and he said you know what i heard and i mean when he hears something like he told me a week before me he's like by the way next week do not do anything on this date madonna tickets are going on sale i was like right what like we haven't heard madonna's he's like it's coming from me this is a real thing and i'm like oh shit you're right he told me about jack and she did say page six asked her when she was walking i think one of the carpets like i don't know which one would you ever be on beverly hills housewives and i mean it was like a staged question obviously you know it's gonna be a headline i mean but she said yeah so i mean i don't know but she would be if that's real you oh know? my god i told my this friend i said if she does it you have to do it i said just it, it, there'll be so many people watching it'll be like the first season just takes off instantly she's hysterical i love her 
that's what they need. You know, that's how Salt Lake got cast. It's because they they went. I mean, I think it was Lisa. I think Lisa Barlow actually put this together. Like she went to them and said, Ooh. here are that's here here's my yeah. friend group and they were like a salt lake you know just like the rest of us and then when you scratch the surface you're like this woman slept with her grandfather and she has a church that's apparently up to no good and then you right. meet like think about and then they're like wow because salt lake was great the first two seasons right. it really you so think, i that's the is key. that gonna, is that show going to get canceled though you think apparently it's like back and it's going to start filming soon i mean ugh, oh. I don't i don't know how I don't know how. I mean, it was like the OC the past two seasons was horrible. And this is right up there to me as like one of the worst housewife seasons ever. It was just, I, I couldn't even watch it. I was so bored. Did the reunion for that show happen yet? Got a little better. I see, that. I, see I can't even remember it. Or maybe I didn't watch it. They had, I just I mean, felt like that season was horrible. Horrible. Yeah. Horrible. So that would be great if like, I mean, that's what they need. Like if Jennifer Coolidge did it, I mean, that's the thing. People would be more excited about that than, I mean, I don't know. Is anyone waiting for the Roni reboot? I mean, look, it, it could start and it could be great if it has that New York feel, but I'm not like on the edge of my seat waiting for it. You know, no. like. And Orange I'm County not. is like boring, right? I mean, they brought Tamara back. I mean, to me, it's like, that's like two episodes. Like she's going to make up with Shannon. Vicky makes some appearances. Like, I don't know. I don't know if Tamara could save the OC. I, I mean, she's, she's, I, to me, Tamara's the last straw. Like if she can't save right. this, because she is funny. good at her job. She really right. is. She's really good at her job. I, if she can't save this, I think it's time to call it on the OC. Like once you cancel new york or reboot it whatever you want to say i think that the, the floodgates are open we could just do right. it room and listen and i've had her on twice i love heather dubrow as a person she is wonderful so uh, that's no shade to heather dubrow i i love watching heather dubrow and terry i i do but it didn't work and not them just the whole show didn't work so if tamra can't i didn't even i i couldn't watch it like i just had zero desire i didn't watch that and i i still haven't watched um i shouldn't say it. i i've seen one or two episodes of miami based on you saying oh my god that's the and everyone says like why is that not on bravo why is it on peacock this season was great well, really what you should do is just you no only more? missed one no but it's it's well, good but you know what you really should do you should just watch new jersey you just missed the first okay. episode that okay, is okay. what you I should watch because okay, that okay. is like gangsta, and you're just gonna yeah. be like, oh my god! And it's good, and it's just, it's it's that's what you should do, and then you can come back on and talk about that. Yeah, I'll have all sorts of opinions. That was honestly that show is what got me sucked into watching Housewives was Jersey. It's, I mean, I think this is Melissa's last season. I mean, Teresa is just fully, truly done with her brother and Melissa. Done. She's like done. She's like not speak like it's it's over. It's and over. like the audience is over it too. Like this has right. been going on. It's like so and other unlike Kathy and Kyle, it's mm -hmm. real. Like they're really done. For right, real. right. Right. So did, did Melissa have an affair? I'm just asking. Is that the, did I read that that's the rumors? I believe, yeah. So you've definitely read that. I okay. know the person. I, I know all these people. The guy? I think yeah. And I, met him i mean when i say no are we best friends no have i met him a n number of times yeah um i 